Hey guys, welcome to today's video. We are gonna be playing with an overpriced face mask. I have the 111 Skin Crystallizing Energy, Energizing Energy Mask. Honestly, I saw that this crystallized and I was like, hey, another weird product to try. And then I looked at the price and I was like, hey, why is that $200? This is annoying me. Uh, I have a New Year's resolution that I haven't shared with you guys. It's to stop buying shirts with holes in them. Why am I doing this to myself? This is like getting like unnecessary. Like, is this fashion? Do you guys like this? Sorry, I was yelling into the mic. Do you guys like this? I can't decide. I ordered this off a of Revolve and I kind of put it on and I was like, we're going down a pathway that I don't know that I am comfortable with. Like, why, why did I order this? Anyway, I'm kind of a mess. My hair is up out of the way. I've got not the cutest headband on and I basically just woke up. The first thing she sees is packets of product. How many do you get? One, two, three, four. Oh, you get five. Okay, so you get two packets. One is the activating gel and one is the treatment mask. I'm guessing that you mix these two together for a really fun time. Okay, I see a spatula for mixing. All right, you get a little bowl. You get a little cloth, I'm assuming, to remove the crystals once they have dried. The thing that I am just like, ugh, when I was reading the back of this, you have to leave this on for 40 minutes. I don't know why 40 minutes makes me go, that's just too long. Like I like putting a sheet mask on, waiting 10 minutes, taking it off and being done. So this is one that you do wanna wait a long time to crystallize and do what it's supposed to do. When reading up on this product, I did notice that it is free of silicones, parabens, paraffins, it's suitable for all skin types, even sensitive. Uh, it is said to give a firming, energizing effect. I mean, a lot of these things you read up on and you're like, yeah, cool, sounds good, sounds good, sounds good. How long does it take to make my skin do that and how long will it last? Let's just do this, okay? Let's just, let's just do it. Step one, cleanse skin. Did that. Step two, dispense treatment mask and activating gel. All right, that's the step that we're at. Let's make sure we... Do this correctly. Uh, James did not want to be in this video today. I try to get him in my face masks videos when I can, but he was like, nope, you're on your own. <laughs> oh God, geez, it smells like a foot. Next up, we have the activating gel. It smells like nothing. Um, it's really kind of hard to get the activating gel out. I feel like I'm not getting like enough of it. No, I have it all over my hands. God. <laughs> Michael, <laughs> Michael, <laughs> Michael, please. Stir for two minutes. What? <sighs> okay. I am so bored. I feel like I'm making slime right now, actually. Two ingredient slime, viral video coming to you. I just wanna know what, how did they come up with two minutes? What happens at the two minute mark? <laughs> what if I don't stir it for two minutes? Then what? I'm ready. Now that we have stirred for two minutes, it says to put a thick layer on your face. <sighs> I feel like a little cupcake right now, like I'm frosting a cupcake. It's very cold. Once everything has been mixed together, it does not smell as potent as that initial packet did. So it doesn't really smell like anything, actually. Uh, cool. So I'm gonna hang out for 40 minutes. Let's check the time right now. It is 11.54. I will see you guys in a little bit and we're gonna see if this crystallizes and I'll do a close up to show you guys the crystallizing action. And yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit. And here we are again with a very attractive looking face mask. It is now 12.53. I let this sit on my face a lot longer than the 40 minutes because I really wanted it to crystallize. Like I can't even talk, oh my gosh. Some of it started crystallizing, we can see. Like when I press on it, it's so weird. Look at that. Oh, oh, disgusting, but interesting. Um, then other parts of it, it's said to go thick, but it feels like it's just not gonna dry down. So I think I went a little too thick. It almost feels like rubber. It's like, it's, it's gonna peel off, but it's not a peel off mask. What is happening? I'm not supposed to do that. 
Um, okay, this is really interesting. Look at this. It just like cracks. It's like ice, like stepping on like fresh snow or like ice. So weird. Oh my God. I think I'm at the point where I need to just rinse this off because it doesn't say to peel it off. It says to rinse it off. And it gives you a very special specific towel. So I'm gonna go to the sink and do that. And I'll be right back. And clearly I have rinsed off the remaining mask bits that were partially gel and crystallized. This is just a weird mask, but I do have to say my skin feels like a baby's bottom. It feels really smooth, even though this wasn't an exfoliating mask, it just feels super plumped and hydrated. So it did do something. I think 40 bucks for each treatment is a lot of money. And also it was really, really difficult to rinse off because it was gel and then crystal parts. It was kind of like getting everywhere. But I do think the reason they have you rinse it off instead of peeling it off is because it almost liquefied and felt like I was pressing it even further in the skin. I don't know if that's maybe the science. That's a, a guess. I don't know if that's true or not, but it felt nice to rinse it off. It was just pretty messy. So this is a look at my skin of kind of what it did for me. I think my skin looks good. So we have zoomed back out and my shirt is annoying me even more at this point. I can't even focus on the skincare because I'm just looking at the shirt and the bandana and I know someone out there is gonna screen grab this and make some horrible meme about me. And I'm just kind of like, oh, why? Oh, I just wanna rip it because my new year's resolution partially was to not stress out about what other people think and see what I'm doing. I'm stressing out about what other people think. Here's the scoop, you guys. My skin feels freaking awesome. I don't know that you need a $40 treatment at home. If you were gonna do this in place of a facial, I think that would be one thing because it does have ingredients that are really going to moisturize and plump the skin. The delivery system, looking at it a bit closer, is pretty cool. And I do know that 111 Skin, which I did purchase this myself, let's get clear about that. This is created with ingredients that helped astronauts when they injured their skin in space. There's some story behind the technology and science and the skincare and it worked so well that then they developed a skincare line. I'm always fascinated by those stories. I'm like, oh, whoa, if it can work in outer space, then it can work on my face here on planet Earth. Um, imagine that. So this treatment I will use again. I did enjoy it. It has its drawbacks that it is messy. I won't use as thick of a layer next time, even though it does kind of confuse you because it says use a thick layer. Clearly I used too much because it did not all crystallize and I wanted it all to crystallize. It worked still, my skin feels great and I'm happy with it. It does have a triple ceramide complex. I love that aloe. When you mix the two parts, it creates carbonic acid, which pushes CO2 into the skin. That's something really different. I don't really see that on many face mask jars. So this has a lot of technology in it. It even has, let me get this straight, chlorella vulgarism. I am probably saying that incorrectly. It sounds awful, but apparently it's great for your skin. I mean, they just list like boom, 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 this, that, this, hydrate, energize, brighten, and it does everything it says it does. I really like this. I like the ingredients. It is a bit of a mess. It is very expensive, but at the end of the day, if you want something like this to try out that will plump up your skin for a special occasion, then I say go for it. If you don't wanna spend the money, you don't have to. There are other options out there that are not this high price, and I am gonna find those for you as well. All right, I love you guys so much. I hope that you are having a wonderful day, and I will see you all in my next video. Thanks so much for hanging out with me, and if you feel generous, hit that like button. All right, I love you guys. Mwah.